हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ योर पी डी आई इंजीनियर ग्रेड पॉइंट सो आई एम वेरी शर्मा योर मेंटर ऑफ मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग सो बेसिकली आई एम हेयर टू डू द प्रीवियस ईयर पेपर एनालिसिस ऑफ द बी डी एल ओके सो एज यू नो इन द्यू इन द लास्ट मंथ मे नंबर ऑफ अपॉर्चुनिटीज हैज़ बीन देयर फॉर द मैकेनिकल स्टूडेंट्स ओके एंड वेरियस पी एस यू हैज़ अनाउंस देयर एग्जाम्स ओके लाइक वी हैव एग्जाम ऑफ बी एच ई एल बी ई एल एंड नाउ द बी डी एल हैज ऑल्सो अनाउंस द वैकेंसीज ऑफ द मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनिंग okay so basically i am here to do the previous year analysis of that particular exam here so i have done the analysis of the three uh, particular papers of the bdl which is held on the april 2022 march 2023 and as well as as well as the december 2023 okay so before studying the uh, paper analysis here of bdl mt uh, lmt uh, let me tell you the first of all the previous year pattern okay what is the exam pattern is going to be there and how much time is being allotted for each questions so say here you can see in the recent three exams of the management training of the bdl there are total number of questions are 150 here okay and to solving this 150 questions we have around 120 minutes okay so this exam is going to be of 2 hours and there will be a 150 questions here okay so if i just tell you the parts from where the question has been asked so here you can see in this specifically in this bdl mt exam we also have a non technical portion along with that we have a technical portion okay so from the mechanical subject if we talk about i am not including the mathematics here i am not uh, considering the engineering mathematics here so if you see there are number of questions which is, has been asked from this particular topic okay so here you can uh, uh, just see here and do the analysis here like we have a uh, 60 questions 60 questions roughly around 60 questions from the non technical part and the remaining 90 questions has been asked from the technical part here okay so this 90 uh, questions are directly framed from the technical subjects specifically from the production engineering specifically from the theory of machine and specifically from the strength of material okay and here also uh, if uh, see i have also done the analysis of the bh bhel as well as the bel okay in that exam the engineering mathematics is not in your, in the exam itself or it is not it is not mentioned in this syllabus but in the case of bdl exam you have also have a mathematics so okay so i can say there is roughly around 20 15 to 20 questions okay or around 10 to 15 questions 10 to 15 questions are directly asked from the mathematics part and the remaining 15 to 20 questions i has been asked from the aptitude part here okay so i can say uh, for clearing this particular exam you also have to prepare the engineering mathematics okay and if we talk about the specific important topics related to the mathematics so here i have been observed that the most of the questions have been framed from the differential chapter okay calculus part along with that the matrix part is also very very important for you okay so you cannot skip three chapters from the engineering mathematics the first one is the differential the second one is the calculus and the third one is the uh, matrix part here okay so now if you see uh let's move to our next uh, the analysis of the mechanical portion so in the mechanical portion specifically the production engineering has been asked a lot here so here you can see in the 2022 exam as well as in the 23 exam around roughly around 30 question has been framed from this particular subject which already comprises of 20% of the entire exam here so we can say the 20% of the exam is directly coming out from the production part only okay if you see in this case in december 2023 number of questions are there even though it is less than the 2022 and 20, march 2023 but significant questions are there okay or out of the remaining subjects uh, along with that uh, we have seen a number of questions from the strength of material so strength of material is very very important for you for this particular exam production engineering is very very important for you along with that heat transfer is very very important for you and specifically the fluid mechanics part here okay and i have already told you that uh, in the case of the bhel like i have told you in the uh, previous video of the bhel in that exam the numeric laws of numerical has been directly asked even though from the topic of production engineering but in the level of this bdl exam is exactly similar to the uh, bel exam that is bharat electronics limited so i can directly say that in the exam of bdl bharat dynamic limited as well as the exam of bel bharat electronic limited all the questions are directly from theoretical portion only okay you don't have to prepare the numerical part here okay in the case of bel the number of numericals are very very less it is around 5 to 10% but in the case of bdl exam there is no numerical at all okay entirely the 
questions are theoretically based okay so if you have a just basic idea of all of the subjects you can see directly clear this particular exam here that's a very simple exam the questions are very straightforward okay you just uh, you are going to take only 5 to 10 second if you have a very uh, clear understanding of that particular topic okay so uh, and now such see uh, here you can see the total number of questions from the mathematics and the aptitude questions are around 30 out of 30 10 to 15 questions are from the engineering mathematics specifically from the topic of differential calculus and matrix and the remaining 15 to 20 questions are directly from the aptitude part okay along with that we have also here uh, also we have a general english part along with that we also we have a reasoning question here okay so if i compare the level of all of three exam which are uh, parallelly going on nowadays the BHEL, BDL and BEL, the level of BDL and the BEL is exactly similar. Okay. In the BDL exam, all the questions are theoretical. In the case of BDL exam, all the questions are uh, theoretical here. Okay. But if we talk about the BHEL, Bharat Heavy Electronics Limited, there are number of questions from the numerical portions there. Okay. So you have to prepare this uh, subject very carefully, very thoroughly in the case of BHEL exam, which is uh, roughly around, uh, which is going to be held in April or May here. Okay. So here you can see, uh, if you are already enrolled in the program of the BEL, Bharat Electronics Limited, then that particular content is very, very sufficient for you to clear the BDL exam also. Okay. For just clearing the BDL exam, you, uh, you have to do one thing uh, extra that you have to cover the engineering mathematics. Okay. And we have already shared the module of mathematics with you, uh, with the BEL exam also. Okay. So if you have already enrolled the BEL, you are going to cover up the uh, entire technical subject along with that we have already shared the module of mathematics with you okay so that will be helpful for you uh, for the BDL exam here okay and after the exams of the BL and we are also going to uh, start the modules related to the numerical portion okay which, which is going to be very very important for you for the BHL exam okay so I can simply say that if you have uh, if you have already enrolled in the BEL exam that will be sufficient for you to clear all the exams of the three parallel exams here and you if you are not uh, enrolled yet right now okay you can enroll in the bl program which will further help you to clear the clear the all the exams here okay so in this case uh, let me tell you one more thing like if you remember in the case of bel i have already done the analysis of bel okay i have told you that there the applied thermodynamics is not so much important for you but for the bhel the applied thermodynamics is a very very important for you in this case also if you see a very less number of or i can say none of the question has been asked from the applied thermodynamics part which consists of power plant refrigeration and ic engine you can see in the direct uh, in the recent exam none of the question has been asked from from that particular topics so you can directly simply uh, skip that portion here and you can just focus on specifically on the basic thermodynamics there we have to cover the laws of thermodynamics along with that you have to cover the uh, simple entropy internal energy work heat concepts here okay but in the case of heat transfer heat transfer is specifically very very important for you for the bdl exam and in this case uh, you have to cover up the heat exchanger portion along with that you have to cover the radiation part okay and when we talk about the fluid machinery in the case of fluid machinery also very less number of questions has been asked from that particular topic and the questions are very directly they have asked you a question that uh, what kind of turbine is this okay what is the meaning of impulse turbine what is the meaning of reaction turbine okay how do you categorize the kaplan turbine okay Th that type that type of questions has been asked from that particular topic and in the case of march 23 the number of questions which has, has been asked from the fluid machine is zero here okay so i can say this exam is particularly focused on your basics of mechanical engineering that means they are not uh, asking you to prepare the practical applications there they are asking you to uh, cover up the just they, don't, they just don't want, want to uh, want you to have a basic understanding of the entire mechanical engineering subjects like you have to prepare the basic of engineering mechanics you have to prepare the basics of strength of material along with that here you can see the basics of production engineering okay and the basic of machine design and none of the portion is there from the application part here okay so that is that exam is going to be very very uh, simple for you so that is a very nice opportunity uh, for all the mechanical candidates okay and you can hopefully clear this exam very uh, in a very short period of time if you prepare it, the entire content of mechanical engineering uh, in a very precise way or in a very perfect manner okay so uh, this is the video which i am going to share here so i hope it is very uh, clear to all of you okay so just prepare, just continue your preparation with the bel module only okay and that will be sufficient for you to clear the bdl exam also 
and along with that it will be sufficient for you to clear the bhcl module also okay and the all the numericals which we have uh, which is there for the bhcl module will be started up the after the exam of BD, uh, bel only okay and the remaining thing the engineering mathematics uh, which is required for this particular exam is already being shared with you with your bel module okay so that will be sufficient for you to uh, cover over the entire syllabus here okay so thank you very much so i hope it's uh, very clear to all of you okay so all the best for your all the best for, for your preparation here